five past five on a Thursday evening. I've just finished work and it is time to go to Christchurch. I am flying down there tonight to meet my parents who are already down there in their camper van. Mm. Is this gonna shut? That's a bit concerning. We're going to the New Zealand House and Garden Tour tomorrow, which mum and I try and do this with a couple of mum's friends every year. We've been doing it for probably like eight years now. So we try and go to like a new place every time. So we've been to a few in Auckland, a few in Tauranga. This is my second one in Christchurch. Been to one in Taupo. So we kind of try and do them all around the place. And since mum and dad were gonna be in Christchurch, on the weekend that it was happening in Christchurch, I was like, I'm gonna come too. So it's mum and dad and I, plus a couple of mum and dad's friends, and that's happening tomorrow, but I need to get to Christchurch. Because mum and dad are down there in the camper van, I will also be staying with them in the camper van, which I haven't done. I was trying to think of this before. I don't think I've stayed with them in the camper van since I spent like 10 days with them in the camper van at the end of 2020, so. <laughs> this is gonna be a fun time. The Uber driver. <laughs> Oh, is it a plane? Oh, whoa, that's huge! Kia ora from Christchurch. My flight was delayed by like an hour. It's currently 25 past nine. Look at that. That is my ride. That is my house for the next 48 hours. We're going to the Kaipoi NZMCA park. Yep. Bula. Bula. <laughs> it is 10 p.m. We've made it out to the campground. This is my bed for the night, it's also my couch, it's also where the barbecue lives, it's also where my suitcase is living. I had dinner at 4.30, my plan in my head was finish work, dinner, airport, but then I ended up sitting at the airport for like an extra hour on top of the already probably 45 minutes that I had to wait. Ended up finishing a whole assignment for my PT course which was cool, but I'm now very hungry. Selection. Oh, I've got options, so, oh. <laughs> is it the salmon one? Yeah, I haven't opened that one yet. Can I open it? Yeah. So many options, this is great. Good morning from the camper van. Mum's on tea duty this morning. It's like living a little bed and breakfast. Oh. Adam, would you like blood orange, tropical, raspberry and strawberry, peach and pineapple? Let's go peach and pineapple. It is half past seven and had a shower this morning. It was actually a really nice shower. It's good. It is quite good. You just, have to, you just have to be quick. We're leaving here at about eight o'clock to head into Christchurch. Yep. And we're meeting our friends at their house. They live in Christchurch. So we're meeting them at their house so we can take their car to the houses today. So that because there's like how many? Is there like nine, ten houses? Ten. There's a lot, eh? Mm. But they're quite close together, which is cool. The parking won't be camper van friendly. We always see people in camper vans when we do other tours, and it's kind of like, oh, poor you. Yeah, poor you. So we're not going to be those people. Oh, camper van toaster. You guys need to see this camper van toaster. This camper van toaster is awesome. There we go. And you chuck it on the gas hob and stick your toast on and it does the best toast. We've got Vogels, guys. This is like real fancy stuff. Don't take your eyes off it. Okay, my eyes are on it. It's a little bit, uh, a little bit burnt on. I'll just turn it over and we don't even have to know. Got my phone charging. Dad, what's, what's my phone charging on? What have you got set up here for us? For charging? Yeah, tell us about your solar power. Oh, yeah, look. The solar <laughs> comes into here. Yeah. We've got 86% battery left. Under here we've got oh, two big lithium there. batteries. Wow, they're quite fancy. How many solar panels on the roof? Two big solar panels that are 660 watts altogether. This oh. runs through an inverter which feeds and 240 volts. Yeah, we just plug our phones in here and it's charging like normal. Volts. Yeah. So yeah. fully, yeah. fully self-contained. Yep. Fully self-contained. We're at house number two. I can't show you the house, but I can show you. We just got some brownies and we're waiting for hot chocolates mm. at the moment and coffees. What's everyone's opinions on the first two houses? House number one, what do we think? Um, yeah, cool. In interesting. Interesting. Unique. Mm -hmm. Unique. Not my cup of tea. <laughs> Not your cup of tea. Too dark. <laughs> TV too still lovely, I wouldn't say no. <laughs> <laughs> Greg's having a great time. I'm gonna have my half. This is a raspberry dark chocolate brownie. Mm. We're at house number three. Garden is really beautiful. This house is our favourite so far and it's been really interesting. We have a lot of art at home from this artist called Ivan Clark. He's a friend of mum and dad's and his art has been in all three houses so far. We're tracking well. It's quarter past three so we have 45 minutes to get the final two houses. We're currently in like the Ponsonby of Christchurch and the houses are so flash. Million, million, million dollar homes. Absolutely insane. We're about to head out to mum and dad's friend's place. The last house was phenomenal. But anyway, they have this hub that you can go to and they have like the show sponsors and you can go and get little freebies. And every year they have Rosine there and they have these little boxes that are full of M&Ms. So I've just been snacking on these all afternoon. It's quarter past five. We're heading out to Lincoln. Like basically all of mum and dad's pharmacy friends live down here from their study at uni. I really hope that when I'm my parents' age that I still have my uni friends 
who are living all across the place that I can just go stay at their houses. <laughs> people we went with today, pharmacy school friends, and the people that are going to stay at tonight, also pharmacy school friends. Good morning. <laughs> We're just having some breakfast. Just discussing what our plans are for today. We don't really know. It's only 10 o'clock already. I don't have to be at the airport till 4. Mum was floating the idea of going on the tram. Maybe go on the Avon River on one of the little Venice boats. What are they actually called? They have a name, eh? Pant. Oh, that's not the name that I thought it was. <laughs> Been hit with the targeted marketing. I'm going to show you guys how good I am at putting. That's actually the first one that I've gotten. Oh, oh. Oh. Nice. Today is the 24th of February and Drive to Survive came out last night. We're about to sit down and have a little family viewing party because Liam is in episode 9 apparently. So we're going to just sit down and watch episode 9. We were going to do the Avon River thing but apparently it's... There's the only availability is at 3 o'clock and I have to be at the airport at 4. I am just packing my bag because we're about to go. And we're taking their car into town so that we don't take the camper van in. I won't be coming back here so I have to take all of my like my suitcase with me. It's 20 to 1 so I think we're going to go straight to the Riverside Market and have some lunch. This has literally been the fastest trip ever. My brother rang before as well and he's picking me up from the airport. And I was like, oh, I'll just like make sure we were at the airport tonight at 6.30 to pick me up. He's like... Oh, I thought that was tomorrow. No, Matthew, it's today. Welcome to the back end of the Riverside Market. Patrick Star. Oh, this is a cute. Have you seen? Yep. Oysters. I went out for dinner with some friends last week. They tried to peer pressure my brother and I into trying oysters, and we were like, nah, pop the thing out, push it down the top. There we go. That is the ramen. This is takoyaki, and it has got an octopus inside it. That's so good. I need a big container of teriyaki sauce like that at home. That is amazing. Five bucks for a piece of soul. Tastes good? It tastes good, alright. I have to have a bite of this fish. That is good. This is two vlogs in a row now that you've been making bird noises. Part time dad, part time more pork, and part time duck. <laughs> Full time fun adventurer. <laughs> Down at the river at the memorial for the Canterbury earthquake that actually happened in on the 22nd of February 2011 so that was 13 years and two days ago and it's got the names of all of the 118 individuals who lost their lives in the earthquake got this big eel guys don't put your phone in the water oh electric ave is also happening in Christchurch right now and I can hear LAB playing got some lemonade okay. yes, Oh, it's good though, it's good. It's just really sour. See you later. Bye. <laughs> I'm at the airport. I've been here for like 45 minutes. As I was walking into the airport, there's this massive team. I couldn't really see, but I was like, oh, it's obviously a sports team. That's so cool. And then I looked closer and realized it was the Crusaders. So it sucks to be them because they lost the Chiefs last night up the Chiefs. And I can show you. 562, that's me. See you guys in Auckland. Buddy. This was going five kilometers an hour, so they deserve to be two today. <laughs> anyway, I'm back in Auckland. Flight was all good. It was actually it was on time, and we ended up landing early. I'm going back to Matt's because you're gonna show me Uber Eats for dinner. Yay! Yay! Yay. Oh, it's a bag inside a bag. What did you get? I got a. Yeah, the kids' chicken one. It's a beautiful day, and I can't stop myself from falling. It's pouring down with rain. I'm meeting Taya in two hours at shoe science to get uh some running shoes fitted I need to do some meal planning so when i go into shoe science i can also pop to the supermarket on the way home and get my groceries for the week this morning hasn't quite gone to plan but like not in a bad way i was in bed doing my devo time and taya's like oh because she's like helping out with an assignment for my personal training course at the moment so she's essentially like my client and she's like oh, i'm gonna go and do the session like now and I'm like oh bro like that we're meant to do that one together and I was like just come over and we'll do it now so she came over this morning and it took us two hours to get through because we were just yapping the whole time she's gone home and like got changed and stuff so I'm going to her house now to pick her up so we can go to shoe science and get our shoes fitted I just went to go like grab my drink bottle and I left it on the bench at home if you know me I go nowhere without my drink bottle it is I literally may as well be attached to my hand at this point I, I don't know what to do with myself oh no with my emotional support at home on the bench let's go get Taya and let's go get some shoes fitted I'm so excited go bro go Do you feel speedy? I do feel speedy. They sound like I've got clouds on my feet. What have you got, bro? What about I don't know. 
we are Essex girlies. You guys have heard me blabbing on and on about how I'm gonna run a half marathon this year. This is a joint goal. We did the run, he bought in a pair of shoes, tried them on, they were great. And then he's like, okay, I'll bring out a few more options. And so we had three options in total, tried them all on. I ended up going with my OG first option. You went for your second option. Anyway, let's do a little show and tell. Oh, we got some free socks. These are the ones that I have. They are Essex Gel Nimbus. Oh, they're the ones in the window we were joking about before the we were inside. Gel Nimbus 26. Show us yours. Smino right. White. Nice and simple. Both of ours are gonna get so dirty so fast. No, they're not. <laughs> the other ones, I was really like, I literally went on either foot and I was like tossing up which one to get. I had the, oh, how do you, is that Hoka or Hoka or Hoka? Hoka. Um, I Clifton, think. the Clifton Nines. And I was like tossing up between the two, but these ones just felt like I was running on clouds, whereas the other ones felt a bit more firm. Taylor and I have been to the supermarket and I've dropped her back. So I ordered Uber Eats last night and I ordered it today because the, um, there's like this voucher that you can use, but I would tell you guys about it, but it literally expires at the end of this week, so there's no point. But anyway, it gives you $25 off your first four orders. So I just got free pit a pit I just picked it up. I got a chicken Caesar one. Stun in. Time to go home and unpack my groceries and have some lunch because it's uh, half past one. I keep thinking it's a Saturday. It doesn't feel like a Sunday because we haven't been to church yet today. But it is a Sunday and we didn't go to church this morning because we're going to go tonight. Every now and again we like switch it up and go to a night service. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I've been doing some study. I'm on to my last module of my PT course, so I'm so close to finishing. But I'm having a little guitar break because my brain is just, uh, it's not really firing in all cylinders today. If you're a Noah Khan fan, you'd know that uh, he released Forever, like his last song of his full album, like last week or the week before. And I love it. I'm obsessed. It's so good. Well, I don't know why I'm surprised because that man is incapable of writing a good song. Oh, uh, no. <laughs> He's incapable of writing a bad song. Taya. <laughs> it is time to go to church. I don't know where Taya is. I'm, I'm like, I'm gonna go anyway, but I'm just like, now I have to go by myself. Go by myself. I'm not too worried about it. The church I go to, there's like four or five of them across Auckland and I go to one of them. But if I want to go at night time, I have to go to the one right in the city, which is fine. It's great when you have people to go with. This is my outfit. It's all from Dish, apart from my belts. Oh no, one from Princess Polly. I'm like procrastinating leaving because I really want Taya to pick up her phone. Call Taya and put it on speaker. Calling Taya Shaw home on speaker. Taya. Oh. Can't take your call now. No crap, she can't take my call right now. How many times have I called her? Seven times. It's actually time I need to leave. Let's go to church. Got chocolate on my lens. I was like, nah, not today. Tomorrow doesn't look good either. Put that in your CV. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that sucks, man. That sucks. Oh, 